bastard. Where do I go? Ew, bloody locker. Um, you okay? What are you guys doing? You guys need any help? Thanks, but I think we're almost in. We're taking care of it, Lee. Don't worry. Okay. So I guess I go this way. to go to the alley. I think I have to go this way. I don't know. I'm gonna try getting back to that one place. Little help. What? Little help here. I got out. Oh god. Fuck. The doors won't close all the way. Wait, do something. <laughs> <laughs> we yeah. Brace the door with something. No. What the heck? I didn't have enough time. Fuck. The doors won't close all the way. Let me do something. We go. Break the door with something. Uh, come on. Yeah, there we go. Damn well better. There's so many of them. You got the fuel. Let's not start high-fiving each other just yet. Let's get the hell back to the classroom. Give us a hand with these fuel cans. They weigh a goddamn ton. At least everybody's safe. Hey, how'd you guys make out? We got the fuel. Awesome. Good job, guys. How you doing with that door? Not so good. Here, let me give you a hand. Did you get that battery yet? Yeah, Molly has it. She should be back here soon. She'd better be. Why does she keep running off? I'm kind of getting suspicious. Globe. Whoa. Okay, so what do I do now? I think... I'm gonna try to talk to them. No oh, power, okay. no TV. No, really? Okay, well I guess I have no point to be in here, so I guess I'll just get out of here. Am I supposed to? Call out hole? Are you kidding me? Wait, I'm gonna go talk to Ben and Kenny. See if they need anything. Cause I don't know where to go. Pamphlets. Looks like they had quite a system here. Crawford's final solution. What do we still need? We already got the fuel and the battery. Once we find some medicine, we'll be good to go. So where's this battery you found? Molly has it. She ran off to do something. Well, she'd better bring it back here. I don't know why you trusted that girl with it. We hardly know her. She saved your life, didn't she? <laughs> yeah, but what has she done for me lately? No, wait. There is something you can help me with. Something that's been on my mind. I could use your opinion. What is it? It's Kenny. Since I've been helping him work on the boat, I've gotten to know him a little better. He's a good guy, you know? And it's eating me up knowing what I know. 
I've been thinking about telling him the truth. Ben, come on. This again? It's my fault Duck and Katya got killed. If I hadn't screwed up back at the motor inn, they'd still be alive. How am I supposed to just carry something like that around? I have to tell him. If you tell him, he's gonna freaking kill you. Ben, no offense, but have you lost your motherfucking mind? <laughs> he's barely hanging on. You tell him you're to blame? I don't even want to think about what he might do. Oh, I know. No. I've thought about that. But I don't know how much longer I can keep looking him in the eye. I feel like I'm lying to him by not telling him. I'm telling you, man, it's a bad idea. Real, real bad. Hey, maybe you're okay walking around with somebody's blood on your hands, but that's not who I am. I can't just pretend it never happened. Look, we need Kenny. We need him to hold his shit together if we're ever gonna get out of here. So you need to keep this to yourself, for the good of everyone. You hear me? I hear you. I'm gonna get back to this. <sighs> okay. Well, let's go back to the hall. Back to the hall. I'm gonna go check on that door. <laughs> what if I open it? I have no idea where to go. If I open it, we're all screwed. Um, empty lock. See these people. Kristen Vernon must be trapped in there. No, don't hurt me. You're done. Man, that was fun. The first time he actually got to shoot in the game. Well, actually, not the first. <laughs> what the hell happened? They wandered into the hallway after we got inside. I think they must have heard us rooting around in here. The whole place is infested. They're everywhere. Calm down. I took care of them. What about the mids? Did we find what we need? Yeah, that's our other problem. Take a look. Looks like they were keeping all the prescription meds in that safe, locked up tight. There's no way we can bust it open? Maybe with enough time, but I don't know how much of that we have. Be a hell of a lot quicker if we just knew the four-digit combination. Well, I doubt they just wrote it. Oh, and left that it one thing in there. We should just try busting it open. We don't I might have know. any other choice. Know. Okay, you get started. I'll take a look around, see if I can find anything useful. Maybe it was that plan thing. It had like numbers on it, but I have no idea. <laughs> I want to shoot this. Do you think shooting it open would work? <laughs> Only thing that would accomplish is getting us all killed. So no, I don't. <laughs> uh, already cleaned out. Wow, they cleaned out the first aid kit. 
Ooh, a medical file. Looks like some kind of medical file. I want to pick that up. Anna Correa. Guess she must have been a patient here. And what's this? Um... Take time to rest later, I think. Well, I guess I go back out. I don't know. I'm gonna go look for the digit key, though. Or whatever it's called. Why are there, like, people still here? Oh, what is that? Is that like a piece of paper on the floor? <laughs> oh, wait, wait, wait. I picked up something. I don't know. I'm going back in there. Anything. Oh, camcorder. I didn't see this. There we go. Vernon, Krista, come look at this. This is day 82 since the outbreak. 1547. Dr. Logan in consultation with patient Anna Correa. Why are you recording this? Regulations. Oberson has ordered me to keep records of all medical examinations and consultations. I need you to brace yourself, Anna. The sonogram confirms that you're pregnant. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. She's pregnant. As you know, the rules are very clear. The termination is mandatory. You don't have to tell them. Tell them it was just nausea. But you gave me something for it, and it went away. This is my problem, not yours. If Oberson finds out that I concealed evidence of a pregnancy, I'm sorry, but these are the rules. I'm gonna give you a sedative. It'll make the procedure easier on you. I don't want the procedure! I want my baby! I can't do this! I can't do this! Anna, you don't have a choice. Now, if you like, you can take some time with this. But I need you to come back no later than tomorrow. Or I'll have no choice but to inform Oberson myself. I'm sorry. Wow. That's so messed up. Damn it, we almost had it. What the hell kind of place was this? Like Molly said, the worst kind. Lee, maybe there's another tape. We gotta keep looking. I think I recognize that doctor. He was one of the walkers out in the alley by the auto shop. Maybe you should search it, see what he's got on him. I guess so, I'm going back to the alley, apparently. Time to go. Ugh. They make me do all the dirty work. Eh. And the walking in this game, the camera angles are so weird. Ew, what is that noise? Yeah, I can't go that way, so I guess I gotta go back over here. And back in the shed and jump over all this junk. 
Oh god. Whoa, whoa. Oh, what the? Ah, <laughs> uh, the TV fell on him. Drop it.